Hello everyone, it's your girl Yaquara and we do all things here, bougie on a budget. So if that's you and you'd like to be on a budget and you're bougie, make sure you like, share, subscribe, and click the link below. Today we are going to do a what's in my bag and it's my first time doing a what's in my bag so I'm really excited to finally do this. I personally feel like what's in my bag, honestly, none of your business, but I know that's what we all love and, and just to help my customers to see what will fit into their bags, I decided to do this video for you all today. My outfit, simple, just a simple shirt from Old Navy. It's pretty old. Some jeans, some stretch pants from Amazon, and my little Old Navy shoes that I just love and adore that I probably had on in my last video. And I don't care because I absolutely love these shoes. I switched out of my tricolor jewelry and went into my Tiffany's silver bracelet that I purchased straight from the store, my necklace, my ring, and these earrings are like 15 years old. They're so faded, but it's all I could find this morning. And my undergarments, of course, are from your girl, VS. And that's just for all you mature people who know what VS means. That's where that undergarment came from. And I'm loving that spat, splash of seal blue. All right, so let's get right into it. Today I have one of my favorite spring summer Brent bags, and that is my Speedy with the braided strap, and it is a Bandalore. I thought it matched really nicely, so I switched out of my brown bag that I've been wearing all week that didn't match anything because this to me is more of, more of a fall bag depending on what you're wearing. So I switched out of this to look good for my outfit. All I'm doing is just doing errands, guys. I'm not going anywhere special. There's too much going on right now. So anyway, let's get right into it. This video, this bag has a video. There's blue inside. Here's the strap. I did not wear the strap today because honestly, I don't like bandolier with certain outfits. On me, bandoliers go straight down the middle on me and I'm kind of top heavy and it just looks a little, I don't know. I just think it looks a little crazy how it separates me like that. So when I'm wearing something cute, I really don't like to uh, mess up the flow of my top with a strap. So I did wear this today on my wrist as a top handle, and I'm really getting used to this look. It's comfortable for me, and I am actually able to carry the baby and do what I need to do with him with this bag. And I think it's, it's also my the structure of my arm. If you're a little skinnier, maybe it won't be as comfortable and fit. See how it fits like perfectly on me? Um, yeah, so if you're about my size and weight, your arms are, then this bag will probably be nice and cozy on your elbow. All right, so in my bag, I have my DH gate planner. The insert is actually from Louis Vuitton. I do use this side to put business cards. And I think we'll do a review of my dupes, how look, they're looking after a year. I am starting to have some corner wear on this dupe. Um, probably what happened on an authentic, if you're watching and you have an authentic of this, let me know if it's getting corner wear. I have my DH Gate mini pochette. And it's giving a pop of fuchsia, which really makes me happy when I open it up. I've been really debating on whether or not I want this in an authentic because I love the pop of colors in all of my pochettes so much. I have one with a pop of fuchsia, one with a pop of pink, and one with a pop of red. And I love it so much that I don't even think I want an authentic because I have one in each print. I just keep my keys in here with my iPod. 
ears, things. And then I have some allergy meds in here and some lozenges. That's all that will really fit in here. That's another reason why I'm really debating on whether or not I want an authentic because I just use this to hold my keys. The key holders are actually too small for me because as you can see, I like to keep a big key ring. So we have that in there. I also have my new Pasha accessory. There's a video on all of these items. She is authentic from eBay. I have some girly things in here. I have facial wipes to wipe my makeup off at night. Some lip gloss that a student brought me. I thought it was so cute. It's clear. It's rose lip balm. It smells really nice. But um, it's like a lipstick. You would think it's lipstick. So I really love this. If that student's watching, thank you. Yes, unfortunately, some of my students are my friends. Um, no thanks to me, I didn't ask any of my students to be my friends. I didn't tell any of them that I had a page. They just, they put your name in Google and they find you. Hand sanitizer, of course. Definitely gotta have some Lysol wipes these days. I use this for um, the cart for the table when I go out. Some other feminine, thing, feminine things. I have tooth, wax, floss. I think it's a must to have tie to go minis if you're like me and you get spills. Tie to go minis are great. You just push down on it and it'll clean. Definitely gotta have Lysol, whether it's to use the bathroom or to spray your cart or your table. Gum, always have to have gum. My favorite is Orbit Sweet Gum. Everybody's trying to walk past as I'm doing my video. I always carry around a mini tweezer. I love these, Revlon sells them. You can get them on Amazon or you can get them in Walgreens, Rite Aid, all that good stuff. Um, yeah, for those moments for your eyebrows or your chin, whatever. This is NYX Powder Puff Lippy. I don't know, what color is this? You guys know I can't see. Oh, that's funny, <laughs> this is called Teacher's Pet. <laughs> I didn't know that was the name of it. So this is Teacher's Pet. It's like a orangish color. And the NYX liner that matches that. Uh, which is called Brick House, which makes sense. I also love Brick um, Blush. All right, so I'm gonna put all of those things back into my bag. So this is kind of my, I don't know, wipe off sanitation bag. This is kind of what I would take to the bathroom with me if I was to wear my speed to work, which I do not. But if it was a training day where I don't have to bring like a office bag and I brought my speedy, um, this is what I would just grab and go to the bathroom and I would lock this up. So speedies really work for me because I am the type of person who likes to lock up my bags. I always tell you guys, I'm a suburban girl. So sometimes I'm in the city, sometimes I'm in the suburbs and us city suburbs people, we like to be able to lock our things up. If I'm going to the bathroom and I leave this in my classroom and it's locked, I feel more secure about anyone going through my bag. So what else is in here? My DH Gate mini zip wallet. I love this, it has a pop of pink. And yeah, there's some money in there that I take to the bank. So it holds about three, it holds about six cards change and some cash and maybe a few gift cards. And the wear on this so far is really good. I haven't seen where it has any wear or any other lining is coming up. This is a really good dupe. You can barely tell that it's not authentic. Okay. I also have 
had Tums. I don't know about you guys, but I had acid reflux really bad. So I do carry Tums in my bag. I got this lotion from Dollar Tree for a dollar. I love it. It's thick, dove. I have my mask in here. Um, this is an N95. Guys, I bought these from Amazon. It has pink, burgundy, blue, gray, and black. Um, and like a baby blue. And I love these because I can match them up with any outfit. It's also a gray. So if today, if I, I would have went to work, of course, I would have worn more of a shirt underneath of here. And I would have worn my gray mask. And it's always so cute. And it's N95. You can't beat that. Some more acid control medicine. Uh, this pen is Mickey. It belongs in my planner. These planners do have a pen holder in case you guys didn't know. One day maybe I'll buy the big one, an authentic big one, but this one is treating me well so far. I have a pill case that I purchased from Amazon that does um, go with my umbrella. Let me show you guys my umbrella. So these match in my phone. You guys can't see my phone, but I have an iPhone with a green back and, and these match. And this does fit in my speedies. So I'm gonna get me a new one because my husband's been borrowing this one and I'll do one something a tad hair smaller and easier to open, but it does fit. It fits with all of my things. Of course, you guys know I have my knife and my mace that I also purchased on Amazon. I'm not crazy, guys. I'm just trying to stay safe out here. It's a lot of crazy stuff going on. And I personally think you would be crazy not to protect yourself, um, to have something to protect or defend yourself. It, to me, is silly. Okay, so I'm going to put everything back in because I just want to show you really quickly that I have all those things in there. So that's my agenda, my pochette accessory, my mini pochette. My mini zippy. And I just want you to see, okay, so my acid medicine, my mask. But I want you guys to also see if your mom, I can fit about a half a thing of wipes if the wipes is used a little bit. I can fit that in there. A, one diaper. Okay. I can fit one bottle in here. Possibly two bottles, to be honest with you. Can you guys see that? See how there's still room right there for possibly one more diaper? I mean, bottle. And truthfully, you can probably fit a whole thing of wipes in two diapers. Okay? So I've got one bottle in there. This is not my water bottle. This is my son's. I think I left mine in the car, but it's about the same size. And... I can fit it in there, standing up like this, and I can't, but I can't close my bag if you guys can see that. Or I can lay it down sideways, and that's what I've been doing, laying my bottle down sideways, and as you can see, it's not tight. Okay, so that's what I've been wearing in my bags on a regular. You guys know, normally I have lipstick, liner, um, blush, concealer, all those things. But with COVID and with me being on summer break and this uh, monkey pox thing, and my husband and I are just trying to get ourselves together. We have a savings account. We have another car to get. So we really haven't been going out. So I really haven't been wearing a lot of makeup. I've just been bringing like some lip gloss. So um, this is what's in my bag so far. I'm sure when I do another what's in my bag for work, it will have more makeup in it.
So, of course, this is a Speedy 30. And this is also a Speedy 30. And sometimes the special edition ones are bigger, but as you can see, these are the same size. One is a traditional with one zipper and a flap, and one has the two zippers. I don't really see a difference in the zippers. As you can see, this one has two zippers and this one only has one. Some people say this one is easier to get into, or maybe they say it's not as easy because the two, one of the zippers take up space. I personally don't really see a difference. It's just about what you want. This one, you have the convenience of a bandeau to do crossbody, or you can change it to just a shoulder or arm carry. You know what I'm trying to say top handle or arm carry. So the same things will fit in this bag. Look at that, so beautiful. This one is a dupe. This is an authentic from eBay. So I do have my dupe Cherry Speedy with its authentic coin case. And I just wanna show you the comparison between the two. Does the same things fit in a Speedy 25? So guys, I think I'm gonna sit for this part just so I can let you see both bags. Okay, good. All right. So I have my agenda. Only thing I'm noticing is that the, the uh, button is not staying. So I have my agenda. My agenda fits in pretty easily and you can see how much space is in there after the agenda goes in. And yes, my button popped up. It's really annoying me. I have my posh yet that I really want to keep away from the water because I haven't sprayed it yet with apple guard. I'm going to buy some this weekend. I really shouldn't be using this until I get some apple guard on there. I do have some micro core stuff that I can put on there. Put my water bottles to the side. I don't use this color mini pochette in it. You know, guys know I have one to match. This morning ram with a pop of, one has a pop of pink and one has a pop of red. I can choose which one I want. But just for size purposes, once you see it can fit. And we still have some room in there. Okay. My mini deep zip wallet, zippy wallet. Get a little snug but you still the thing about the speedy is you still have room on the edges on a like on this side you still have room my pill case can fit in here my mask and my lotion okay and I still have a little room in here now we're gonna try to fit in my baby stuff. The wipes, half a thing of wipes, and one diaper. And it can go in, but it's not gonna allow me to be accessible to all of my things. So you guys see it'll go in, but it'll be right like on the top. So I would have to pull everything out just to get to like my wallet and whatever else I need. In the bottle, oh, I forgot how it comes. The bottle will fit nice and snug on the side. So just so you guys can see how snuggy that is. In the Speedy 30, these wipes will fit on the side. And I mean, you still probably can. Let's see, all of my things will be underneath. And when I zip in it, still look good nice and full no sagging so that's nice so if you don't mind having to you know pull things out to get to your things fine this 25 will work so you got your mom bag plus a bag for going out without any mom things in there but um i personally think if you're a mom and you have want to carry just a few mom things not maybe not if your baby's under six months but if your baby's over six months and you're running out for a few hours and you just need one or two diapers, a few wipes, and a few bottles. Um, the Speedy 30 can be a mom bag, and I know you wouldn't probably think so, but it can. 
Only problem is um, my water body bottle is now not gonna fit in here. You know, see, my water bottle is now not gonna fit in here at all comfortably. Now, if you're fine with just doing this, cool, but if not, the water bottle's not gonna go. Now, let's see if we can take the baby bottle out. See, I'm just by myself. Baby bottle out. I'm gonna take the wipes out. Now the bottle can fit in here sideways. See that? And if you try to stand it up, it'll be pretty much the same as the other bag. It will poke out. It's not too bad. I'm fine with wearing my speedies open and having a few things hanging out of it because um, the colors on the inside are beautiful to show off, especially if you have this cherry, this blue. So why not show them off a little bit and have it open? But if you're looking for security where you're going, then it's best to close it. Okay. So guys, I'm not currently wearing this bag. This to me is more of a a spring and winter bag. The cherries make it spring. It makes it summer as well. So you can pretty much, because of the cherries, you can pretty much wear this all year round. The cherries make it a spring summer bag and the red makes it a winter bag. Guys, have you ordered this on DHK yet? This bag is so beautiful. Most of the orders that I see are either this bag or my multicolor um, white Speedy Mini. HL, love that bag. Everyone seems to really love that bag. And I just wanna clear some things up. I said I can see what you guys are ordering. I want you to know I don't have any names, any addresses, so I don't know who's ordering what. I can just see the orders. So, um, yeah, so I just wanted to clear that up. And like I always tell you guys, you get what you pay for, and that's the same for me. Um, another thing I wanted to share with you guys, I'm noticing that the genuine uh, authentic Louis Vuitton bags have uh, more. I know I'm so bored in this house, right? You guys hear that? It's a louder sound. It gives a louder sound when scratch it. Now this, this one was loud. You probably, you probably can't tell, but this one is not as loud as. So I'm sure that's another way they authenticate by like the thickness, the sound of it, because that's a totally different sound. This one sounds real, but the hardware lets you know that it's not. The hardware is very um, shiny and cheap looking, but it's, it's a nice dude. Let's see, I've been really enjoying this in here with this pop of red, and they both have a pop of red. It's been really making me happy and making me not really want to be um, authentic. And it's cool for winter because it has like snowflakes, but I, I really love it. And I carry these in here. This is um, a dupe from Walmart. I have a video on this. It has a pop of red. And I like this one because it has a pop of pink. This is from DHK. All of these things have videos on them. So let's get right to it. I'll switch my bags over after this video. Guys, I don't know why you have not been commenting commenting um, in the comment section. It really hurts my feelings. I'm not checking anyone's grammar. I don't care if you spell things wrong. I don't I just I don't care about any of that. I care about us bonding and you asking questions and making sure that you guys are getting everything that you need. Funny little things too, talking about being bougie on a budget. This is a real budget. These lashes are from the dollar store. I think they are like Yoni or something or Noni or something. They were in like a pink. And I don't wear these often. I just kind of throw these on when I'm going out for maybe three, two, three, two, three hours coming home ripping them off. Um, but they are really easy to put on. The glue that comes with it is so easy. I just love it. So as promised, guys, I'm gonna do a giveaway. And yes, we do like the speedies because they do come folded. Even from Louis, they come folded. And this is so that you can take them on vacation. And I have done this, put them in my carry-all. 
I had put two speeds in my carry-all. You guys know I love my carry-all. Not the new one, the um, luggage. And the sister to the keep on and the speedy. And I totally love it. So here's one of my, you guys know I upgraded. If you watch my videos, you'll see that I upgraded my game on speedies. This is like a mid-grade. a three star three and a half star speedy looks really good and again these did come bigger than the original speedies so this is a 25 and just so you can see yes but they're authentic did come bigger than the original 25 and they're both 25 length wise but the width is thicker the handles were also longer so don't let that bother you it comes with a lock and keys and it has a strap. Now, speaking of commenting, I wanna give this to the first person that comments on my video, this particular one. If you're over 16, I'm gonna do over 16 because I don't think anyone under 16 should really be wearing this. Um, really over 18, I would like. I don't know how I'm gonna tell, but um, please, only for mature people because I am going to be mailing this to your house and so I want it to be a, a very professional appropriate transaction for someone over 16 or 18 um, so what will happen you'll be the first person to comment on my page and then I will comment back asking for some information um, from you on my page at precious underscore naturals underscore on Instagram and I will send you this bag and I do wanna see that you're a subscriber. So if I um, talk to you on Instagram, I do wanna see proof that you're subscribed to my channel and you're the first person to comment, I will send you this bag for free. It's a gift from me for being one of my subscribers and commenting on my page. So that'll be the first giveaway. I should have a dust bag for it. And so then I do have two of these, two of these, this one, does not come with the, no, this one has a strap, but it doesn't have a pull tab. And you can easily order this off of Etsy. There's nothing wrong with it. And um, you can easily snap the pull tab on yourself. I will be giving this away in the future. So I do have two. And my third one is like a five star dupe that I upgraded for. So I always get compliments on this bag. So please feel confident when you wear them. All right, I'm interested in seeing who wins this bag. Talk to you guys later and have a great one.